hundred dollars to any man who can beat me. I can teach you how to survive without human blood, you know. You do not get to lecture me on how to live my life. Not anymore. What's your name? Not interested. Well, Mr. Not Interested, you seem to me like a gambling man. I'm afraid you have me all wrong. <laughs> well, that's too bad. I knew a sage once. How sad. You're doing it all wrong. Bad vampire. I was hungry. Now I am not hungry. My quality of form is purely subjective. A woman isn't just for food. She's for pleasure. I do not need a woman for pleasure. I'm spoken for. We are all spoken for in some way. But what is being a vampire if not relishing in the pleasure of it? Come along. Let me show you. Look at the women. They're beautiful, aren't they? Not them. They're too hungry for attention. You want the ones who button themselves up. Watch them. They can't tear their eyes away. Those are the women who secretly crave seduction. They'll put up a good fight, but the game is in winning them over, making them beg for it. What if they don't? You're a vampire. You take it. Last time I convinced you to drink human blood. Yeah. Go ahead, Stefan. Pick one. People, Damon. Yes, they are people, Stefan. People with blood pumping through their veins, waiting to be opened up and sucked dry. You've just forgotten how good it feels. And so had I. But Sage, she reminded me. It's worth it. Stick around for a bit. Who's that? Blast from the past. So give yourselves a hand. Damon Salvatore, my favorite student. Sage, my hottest teacher. What are you doing here? I'm just passing through. Oh, come on. No one just passes through, Mr. Falls. Look all the cat dragged in. Easy there, Rebecca. You know, she used to beat men for sport. She always was quite common. Rebecca, what a happy surprise. What are you doing here, Sage? Well, I heard Finn was finally freed from that casket your rageaholic brother Klaus carted him around in. Oh, Finn, you just missed him. He left town and didn't tell a soul where he was going. He probably went looking for me. <laughs> or quite possibly he forgot all about you. I doubt that. No? Because he didn't seem to mention you. Sorry he came all this way for nothing. Have a nice life. God, I hate that elitist original bitch. Ben? Really? He's my one true love. He turned to me so we could be together forever. And Klaus daggered him and locked him away, and I've been waiting ever since. Please don't tell me that you and Rebecca are friends. Uh, unless you count hate sex. Good, because her and Klaus always treated me like some peasant whore. Yeah, she's just lurking around because she wants something from me. Can't figure out what it is, though. Why don't she get inside her head and find it? Because it's impossible. She's too strong. 
I bet I could get in there. Say she's an original. It's not gonna happen. Have you forgotten everything I taught you? Rebecca may be an original, but she's a girl. You find her weakness and exploit it, I'll walk right in. That is if you want my help. Remember this song? All right, Miss Master Seductress. Where's the victim? Patience. Between her craving for affection and her pathological fear of being left alone, our little get-together is too tempting to resist. Finn's gone, you know. I choose to believe otherwise. He strung you along for 900 years. Didn't bother to call. He's gone. You know, the Damon I knew was holding out for someone, too. Yes, he was. Hope's a bitch, Sage. Get out while you can. I stole it from Nick, who stole it from McQueen. I'm not sure which one. Well, this is depressing. What happened to the party? It just arrived. You can wail, you can swing, you can flail, you can feel like a broken cell. But I'll never give you up if I ever give you up. My heart will surely fail. I told you if you got her comfortable enough, she's an open book. Are you gonna torture me? You're gonna tell me what she's up to? I'd rather show you. A white oak tree. There must have been a new tree to replace the old. It probably got cut down. Do you happen to know who kept the milling ledges during that period? There's another tree. Milling records? Our family made one of its many fortunes selling lumber. That's why Rebecca's been digging around about this stuff. The tree was on our land and milled by our yard. And letters will tell me where it was shipped. The business archive should be around her somewhere. Get upstairs. Make sure you keep her distracted. Rebecca just left. Happy, I hope. Did you find what you were looking for? Yep. In 1912, the Salvatore Milling Company chopped down a forest. It's 
Its most valuable wood came from an old white oak tree that was used to make the Wickery Bridge. These aren't public records, so Rebecca's gonna chase her tail for a long time. So all the wood stripped from the underside of that bridge is basically a weapon that could kill an original. Yep. You see how this could be a problem for me, right? Why? Because of your true love, Finn? Let me tell you something, I meant the guy. You're not gonna miss him. I will rip your head off in two seconds if you take one more step. All right, let's make a deal. You help me kill Rebecca, I consider Finn untouchable. You guys walk into the sunset together. Is that a promise? Yes, it's a promise. They seem to get ruined, don't they? Sorry to disappoint you. Again. You set me up. No. I'm just looking out for myself. I told you I'd save your creepy boyfriend. You lied to me, Damon. The originals are linked. If one dies, they all die. If I could get inside her head, don't you think I'd be able to get inside yours? I should end you. I'm 900 years old, Damon. You're not capable of ending me. Do you really think that I would risk Finn's life for one of your petty revenge fantasies? Let me tell you something. Your long lost love has a suicide wish. <laughs> so when Mama Witch linked him together in a spell, he's the one that volunteered to die. He wouldn't do that. He didn't want to live. Not for you, not for anyone. He doesn't love you, Sage. And when I do find another way to kill those originals, I'll start with Finn. Gather your witch. Let's get his blood and get on with it. You can't force me to help you. No, I most likely could. Or I force when I can persuade. Hello, Finn. Sage. What do you know? True love prevails. It does occasionally have its uses. Easier than torturing him. I have something to do. What do you need from me for this spell? Just your blood and your blessing. Where are you going? I have some unfinished business with Damon Salvatore. I'll say what he did to me. Then you'll understand my retribution is in order. Memory serves me. This is where the natives used to make sacrifices to their gods. This statue was built where we used to rendezvous. Back when you used to have to sneak away from your siblings to see your tawdry lady friend. Assumed after 900 years you'd moved on. I took care of myself. But I never stopped loving you, Finn. I don't want you to die. You've never had tequila before. Mm -mm. That's embarrassing. Seriously, I'm embarrassed for you. Happy now? I'm truly awed by the evolution of mankind. <laughs> hey, Sage. Hey, Troy. You know him? I turned him. You turned him? Why? Because I'm in enemy territory. When your brother and sister called, I thought I might need a little backup. You can't trust anyone here. Two more tequilas? <sighs> uh, cool, I'll uh, let you raise some. Thanks. People have you time. I don't know. A lot. Don't judge me. Finn, you turned me. Exactly, Sage. I turned you. My passion overtook my morals. My passions overtake my morals on a daily basis. It's called living life to the fullest. Face me. Finally. 
Oh, thanks. To living life to the fullest. To living life. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what the hell? The vein. to go all ten rounds. Sage? What is happening to me? <laughs> 